Hi ladies, today I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial for you using the August Kudos which is the Defend Innocence Beauty Box and inside you get a beautiful lipstick in the color Sitting Pretty. It's like a really light pink color. This is my absolute favorite shade of lipstick that we carry. You are also going to get a splurge cream shadow in the color Hopeful. It's also a light pink. You will get a liner in the color Purposeful. It's like a really nice plum. And you'll get our exclusive Defend Innocence bracelet. Now also inside the box, you will get a pamphlet with information on how you can continue to help defend innocence. If you are interested in this beauty bundle or have any questions, please let me know. Now let's get into the tutorial. The first thing I'm going to do is prime my eyes with the concealer. The shade that I'm using is Scarlet. You want to make sure you always prime your eyes before you put on eyeshadow because then the eyeshadow will last a lot longer. Then I'm going to set that with a little bit of translucent powder. You can also use a shade uh, eyeshadow that is the same color as your skin tone. Now we're ready for eyeshadow. The first color I'm starting off with is the color Elated from Palette One, and I'm going to be using that as my transition shade. Next, I am going into palette number three, and I'm going to be taking the color Tickled, and that is going to be my crease color. You can just continue to pile on this color until you get your desired intensity. Now I'm going to take my splurge cream shadow brush and the splurge cream shadow in Hopeful. Get a little bit on my brush, you don't want too much. And I'm just going to put that all over the lid. You want to dab it on, not brush so much. You want to dab so then the product stays on and doesn't just swipe back and forth. Once you've got it placed down, then you can swipe a little bit. And you can always add more if you want it more vibrant. Mm -hmm. 
Now, before you finish blending in the crease and blend the two colors together, you wanna make sure that the cream shadow is fully dry. I would give it about a minute, maybe a little less. Now that it's dry, I'm going to go back in with the color Tickled from Palette 3 and just blend the two colors together to make sure there's no harsh lines. Moving on to liner, I'm taking our color Purposeful. I'm just going to lightly line my waterline. This gives you a nice pop of color. Moving on to eyelashes, I'm going to be using, of course, the 3D Mascara. You already know the gel fibers gel deal. Moving on to eyebrows, I'm going to be using the liner in the color light. Last but not least, no look is complete without a little lipstick. Thanks for watching ladies. Let's continue to defend innocence.